Introducing the towering inferno, Sebastian Fundora. Fundora said he likes to fight on the inside too, even though he's tall, so. This to be one of his handlers, a big shot there by Fundora. And he's getting a lot of leverage on it because of his height. A right hook followed by a left uppercut. And he's trying very hard. Oh, it's as close to possibly going down. Far, he has been unable to do that. He had glimpses of it, Robert. Yeah, taking a lot of leather on his, on the inside. And the funny thing was, he thought he was 66. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Fundora shoots a straight left, and he connected again. You know, the kind of pressure they're putting on each other. You know, it's a straight toe-to-toe -to -toe fight. And Owens looking to close it. It's a big right hook that connected by Fundora. In terms of using that to push off, a big left hook, and Owens going backwards. A laser straight left hand by Fundora. Will Owens survive the round? Owens upright, and this one is over. The towering inferno. Right here is good. You want to touch gloves? You want to make it a war. So he comes right out. Hard body shot. Just can't stay there and take a picture, as they say. Oh, beautiful combination. Fundora nails him with a left hand. <laughs> you know, what do you do? It would be difficult. Oh. Right now, you know, he needs to take a step back. And the right thing after throwing the combination is kind of bumping him away. Fundora is smothering Coda right now. Trying to get a little bit of room. He really doesn't. And now he's patterning him. This fun door. He, he lost close to Jason Rosario. Big uppercut. And break each other down. Look at that combination. Good sharp on shaky legs. Good time for Cotto to hold, but there's no holding Ooh. in him. Referee's getting close. Hard left hand. Referee and that's steps it. in. He's given himself some room so he could from Fundora. <laughs> but he was throwing punches. And this is the end of the round, and you know. Fundora! Protect yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. Another story, but it's a. Ooh, nice left hand by Fundora. Clark at 6 2. Ooh, oh, nice right by Fundora. Who did you feel Lennox had the edge in round one? Uh, I think it was pretty close. Um, Record of 14 and 1. Seven Ooh. wins coming by a knockout. Some nice sharp counter punches. Look at that. Good jab by Fundora. That's right here to Jason Rosario back in 2018. Goes so 29-28 in favor of Fundora. Oh. There's a nice right by. Big left hand by Fundora. I'll tell you that. Oh, he's got him holding. Now Fundora senses that he's got him hurt this round. Oh, that's the left by Fundora. His head or waist, but too much as he's. Now Clark's shuffling. Good left hand. I mean, if you have to separate what's been going on this round. Uh, low center of gravity and uh, power coming from that. Four is normal. I was going to use that line. Oh, it hurt already. It looks hurt. Gallimore, who had been around the division for a long can you imagine how this looks to Through good uppercuts and hooks, fought on the inside, in fact, on Errol Spence and Danny Garcia. It was uh, Gil Ramirez. Was, uh... What is that, Joe? Is that Sky Blue? You tell Famer. You, you, you trained a, a lot of... Coffee Jean Claude. With great leverage as well. Uh, boxers. That they're always in great shape. Yeah, take a very close look here. Ahmed could get hurt. Ahmed's got to move his head. Cole is in and it's over. That's it. Look at this shot. Fondora almost had him out in the opening minute. That's right. You know. And it would be a fascinating matchup. Tantalizing. He just knocked out a guy who's 27 and 1. John Fundora. God bless. Garcia in his American debut. We expected a lot of punches early. But Fundora, you know, Fundora is now the, the boxer, Garcia. You're right. That's fascinating. Oh, and you're six, what, six inches shorter. Fundora, very calm and cool, very methodical. Fundora loves to study tape. Uh, cut around uh, the eye of Garcia. 
It's not discouraging Garcia, but... Might be, uh, uh, you know, a little closer. And then Fandora throwing his punches as well. Well, here, oh. Fandora will come back. Pretty accurate with his punching from long range. Like, lands a left hand, and Garcia with the... Fundora! Touch him off. Good luck. And Fundora, you want to watch the left uppercut if he does get inside. For Zapeda, he was 50. He's going to give uh, Fundora some problems. You know, sometimes those mouthpieces lock up. Range. He's out of range against a normal fighter. Three of this 10 round fight. You know, one thing that Zapeda has not been able to take advantage of to punch you, to hurt you. Tougher for. He's got good fundamentals. I mean, Zapeda's a guy that uses legs and he just can't figure him out, Barry. He's having a hard time getting inside. Yeah. He's already. Yeah. No, no, man. No more. He said no more again. Fundora. This is my commands. If you want to touch gloves, do it now. God bless. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pull your arm out. There you go. Get down, get down, get down. Stay tight. Very space, very space. Doble, doble. Carrera. He's down. Sentadito, firm. Strong bone, strong bone. Sentadito, sentadito. That's it, that's it, that's it. Sebastian Fundora. Olympio, listen, you heard everything, right? Good luck to both of you. Sharp jab that lands for Fundora. There it is. And there's a left. So, you know, it works for Ocampo. Ocampo has to keep doing that. Get whacked by an uppercut and knocked out. Who knows? But what? Oh, nice left hand by Fundora, too. He's a good inside fighter. Toe to toe. Easy path to the to attack as we're seeing here. Ocampo's thrown. There's a clipping right hand. Get on Ocampo. Oh, nice straight left hand by Fundora. Body shot again by Fundora. Straight left hand. Yeah, he gives Ocampo a chance at least to land punches mm -hmm. when he when he uncorks them. Oh, and there it there's is. There's a right hook from Fundora. There's a right uppercut on the inside. Oh, left uppercut. The 12 round distance. He actually was found. What a battle that was. Nice uppercut, nice uppercut. that connect. 153, 154, that if. Definitely, uh, he's he's picking his shots real. Guy, especially, big straight left. Still a prospect, but it's about blossoming into being a contender. Fundora on the inside. Nice combination of hugs, straight left. Antonio Urista is getting hammered by Sebastian Fundora. Then you shoot a big shot, catch it, just like that. To pour out blood in. Yurista, another one. 20 years old from Coachella, California. That's bad. Because you, now you can have a broken. And Ruiz should be watching. Has to really look at this guy. Look, there's a, he, he, he looks like he don't even want to fight. That's it. Thing. over. As he now is 10-0. I wonder if he's done drawing, but I'll tell you, he's catching. He came back with that division. Big left by on you like a soup sandwich. He never stops. Yeah. Who's had the advantage to go over the first two? 
You can see it very close. The great reference concerned. Yeah, he saw what I saw on the tapes, but look, this one holds it. They'll protect the fighter in here. He's ready to stop. There it is. Brilliant future for him. He's just a machine in there. Obey my commands. God bless you both. Touch up. His career. There's a left hand back into the body. Dropped by Charlo. Back into the body is Fundora. A right hook. There's that right hand. Lubin trying to withstand it. A big uppercut. And there's a huge uppercut. Stuns Lubin. A left hook landed for Lubin. Oh my goodness. A down goes Lubin. There's that uppercut that just put down on hammer. And there's a stiff jab, uppercut. Fundora back to an uppercut. Uppercut again. Punch output there, power punch is London. There's a right hook from Fundora, connected with an uppercut. There is a massive knot. Another big time uppercut by Fundora. Has him pressed in the corner. And another uppercut. And now the fight is over. Lubin's face, extremely busted up, swollen. Steve!